Hello, hello, welcome back. Thank you for choosing FTL. I am Forgotten T and I will be your captain today. Alrighty, so we left off in the beginning of an Engi homeworld sector. So we got we gotta play this beginning bit cleverly so that we don't end up having to like backtrack. Because I can get to here if I go here first and then come up here. So if I go from here to here to here. To here, to here, to here, to here. That's that's the way. That is the way. So we'll start here. Oh gosh, I'm running out of fuel. You find an abandoned mining station on a nearby moon. A quick scan shows no life forms. However, you discover a useful drone schematic. Ooh, nice. So I got some scrap and I got a drone. Currently in cargo, do I have to a drone system? I do not have a drone system. You can purchase one from a store. Okay. Faster than one can also shoot down, shoot down incoming lasers. Oh, that's nice. Ah, but those take drone parts to deploy. Sort of like missiles take a missile to, like, launch. Ew, I don't know if I want to bother with drones. Sounds like a little more resource management than I was expecting. Alright, we'll just take that and leave. Alright. You have jumped... You have jumped into the aftermath of what seems to have been a brutal exchange between several ships. Wreckage drifts by your screens, and you can still see the remains of the dying ships sparking and breaking apart. It's hard to determine who the comb combatants were without closer investigation. Oh, let's investigate this battlefield. Scan the battlefield and are able to salvage some useful material from the wreckage. Ooh, we got some missiles and we got some scrap. That's really nice, but I need fuel. I'm, I'm running out of fuel. Oh, that's, that's distress. Let's not go there just yet. Let's go here first. Ship refueling station is stationed at this beacon. We can purchase fuel. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. I need fuel. All of the fuel. Yes. Ha. Oh, ha. Oh, that makes me feel so much better. All right. Let's head to the one, two, three. One, two, two, oh yeah, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Small civilian ship flies over as soon as you arrive. You're prepared to fight, but they just inform you that they're out of FTL fuel and can't jump. Give them fuel and wish them luck. But I just got, oh, I just got fuel. Oh. Do I give them four fuel? That's, ooh, that's that's an expensive price to pay. Mm. Yeah, let's do it. I hope I don't get stranded. Ah, thank you so much. We don't have to offer. Have a look at the sector scans we took. Okay, that's more useful early on. Oh, that's a store. Cool. Let's go get let's get some fuel and uh, fix our ship. Inky can do remarkable things with just a pile of scrap. The Inky Hive at the Beacon are selling equipment for just that. Inky and people. Yeah, I don't, I don't... Oh, but you've got skills. Oh... Yeah, no. Systems. Cloaking cloaks a ship. Oh. Oh. That's really useful, but I don't have nearly enough money for that. Let's fix our ship. And let's get some fuel. Oh, it's three scrap per one fuel. Oh, that's expensive. Oh, but I need fuel. Uh... Oh, that was expensive. Alright, what else are you selling? Weapons that I don't need. 
how much will you take for this defense drone? Because it takes three energy. Yeah, it takes three power bars. I don't have three power bars. I'm going to have to install a drone system, which is 85. Oh, it comes with a drone. Okay. That's why it's so expensive. I'm going to hold on to that, in case I manage to get a drone system for cheap somewhere. Alright, now let's pop over here, and then I'll probably take the long way around here. Yeah. You arrive at a Zoltan research facility. They say they are researching genetic distortion due to stasis sleep and prolonged FTL travel to ask if your crew has time to undergo a few scans. Sure, I'll participate in your anonymous survey. Your crew calmly lines up the Zoltans to take their readings. After a short time, the process is done. They contact you. Thank you for your participation in our study. Please accept these small cat cakes made from stiff dough, as well as some scrap. Oh, that's, that's nice. They gave me some money. Cool. All right. I'm going to take the long way around, because I don't need that store. Just yet. You, inf you inform a nearby station of your flight from the Rebels. They offer to outfit your ship with a weapon and wish you well. Ooh, you're giving me a gun for free. Oh, that's really nice. Oh, it's just a firebomb, and it just starts fire. No, I don't I don't need that. Cause that takes one but yeah, I don't need that. So uh I don't have time to go there, I've gotta go to the store now. An Engi ship hails, engine upgrade necessary for travel home, sale of equipment necessary for engine upgrade, okay. Oh, I don't need that. Ooh. Is that worth it? 10% more scrap from any source. I think it is. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to, and how much does it sell? 60, okay. I'm going to sell the firebomb that I don't need. That. Mm. It's 75 to get another weapon slot for my weapon, so then I can, so that sells for 19. So that makes it like 58-ish, if my quick math is anywhere remotely close. If I sell this. Because this can disrupt systems. Yeah, okay, let's, let's try that and see what happens. Ooh, I hope I'm not making a mistake. Oops, nope, come back. I needed this. Oh, that's expensive. Not enough power! Oh, I need a power bar! Ah! We'll steal it from Medbay then. Medbay doesn't need it just yet. Well, that's fun. They rearrange on, on your ship. Cool. Okay. Um, 
Let's go back to the store. I have 17. Is there anything else I could sell? I'm going to sell that. I just, I don't have... I don't have the required stuff for it, and it's just too expensive to get the rest of it, so... I don't need either of these people. Although you're really good at repairing. But... I can dismiss people. But I don't get anything for it, so... Nah, we'll just... We'll just stay there. I'm gonna come here. I'm gonna come here and play with my new toy. As soon as you jump into the system, you receive a hail from a nearby civilian Engie vessel. Their captain appears on your screen. Strange bug, can you assist in debugging? I'll, I'll listen to your problem. Found malfunctioning mantis. Believes it is human, will receive input only from human. Danger valuation extremely high, provide assistance. Oh. Do I send. Will receive input only from human. Okay, I'm gonna send one of my human people over. Because I feel like he's gonna just attack my mantis, and I've, I've only got one of these, and I've got a couple of humans. So we'll hand him over. The mantis is grateful to see another human and introduces himself as Robert Smith. He explains he's from a nearby human colony and would appreciate being returned there. Yeah, I'll, I'll return Mr. Smith home. The colony is a mining operation that specializes in FTL fuel. Robert's family, the head engineers, are excited to see him and are very grateful for his return. Apparently he ran away to join the Federation like his brother but was never accepted onto a ship. Oh, I can offer him a position on my ship. My engines are fine. I want the crew member. Yes! But now I am over people, so who do I dismiss? Do I get rid of Davian or Munzvik? So let's see, you're good at fighting. You're good at captaining. Is anybody else good at captaining? No. Okay. Toodaloo, Monsvik. Thank you for your service, but your services are no longer required. And now I've got two mantises. Ooh, and you're you're good at weapons. So how how good are you at weapons? Not. So you come here and you just kind of sit. Oh, I have to do this the long way. Okay. You just sit here and provide power to there. You two just chill. Save that configuration. Technically, you can be in any room that has a system. So, actually, I don't have anybody on a scanner. So, if you come over here, that's a system. You're powering the subsystem and I get my, oh, why do I not have enough power? Do you have to be in a main system room? You have to be in a main system room. Never mind, because you can't be in here either, can you? Nope. That's a shame. All right. Go back and stand in weapons. You sit here, and then I've got that back. Actually, I'm going to get another energy bar. So I can have medbay going because I feel like I'm going to regret not having that extra energy bar if I end up not having it. So yeah, save that current crew position. All right.
I never got a chance to play with my toy. Oh well. We'll head to the exit then. You arrive at the Long Range Beacon. Ooh, you arrive near a damaged and dilapidated space station. It appears to be abandoned, but you detect faint life signatures on board. Look for survivors or scrap some of the debris. Ooh, I feel like if I try to look for survivors, I'm going to lose somebody. Ooh. Ooh. Let's look for survivors. All around you is the stench of death and decay. Suddenly, one of your crew board crew bends over and starts retching violently. Some sort of disease. Oh no! Must have wiped out the station. You pull back to the ship, but it looks like your crew member is not going to make it. No! Who am I going to lose? Your crew member insists that you leave them behind, not wanting to endanger the rest of the crew. Knowing the truth of this, you hurry back to the ship. Oh, I lost Ariel. Oh no! What what were you good at? Oh no, I lost my engine guy. Oh, that's sad. That's... That's upsetting. Well, you come to engines. And that's the system, so I still get my power bar. Dang, I knew that was the kind of thing that's like, nope, this is a trap. I'm gonna lose somebody. But I went for it anyway. Oh well. Okay. So if I jump out here. The rebels are about to be. I'm gonna head out to the distress and pop back because I think I can do that without there being a problem. Keyword on think. You arrive at a smoldering Engi research station. It's distress call unanswered. Attacked by pirates or a mantis, most likely. There may be someone left alive. Yeah, aboard the station. Ooh! You're awaiting reports of wounded Engi and a functioning drone schematic. Then someone yells. The station reactor is overloading and they're running out of time. Yes! Save the. Oh no, if I save the Engi, I'm gonna lose somebody else. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, I can't risk that it's going to be one of these two people because then really bad things happen. I'm sorry, Engie, but I have to... I have to save themselves. It's a tough order, but your crew's lives are the priority. They drop everything and return to the ship unharmed. You put some distance on the station before it blows. Ah. Uh. Oh, that was a tough call. Alright, let's head back to the exit. Oh no! Oh no! That... that wasn't supposed to happen. Well, I get... I... guessed wrong on how interstellar space travel happens, and they caught up to me. So, now I get to play with my new toy. So, take out the shields, and then, take out the weapons. Shields... Yeah, because you've got a lot of weapons, so let's stop that from happening. We'll do that again, and we'll do that again. Ooh, I don't like this. Oh gosh. You. Oops. Go fix. Oh, that was my thing. Okay, cool. Okay, you. Go fix. Now I can just keep that there and we should be good. think. Missed. Okay, we're good. Everybody return. Mm. 
you are still going to shoot that, but you might have to shoot the shields if they get them back up too soon. Yep. Oh, I missed. That's... That's bad. Okay, take that out. Oops. Oops. Take that out. Okay, I can jump. But I gotta shoot this guy first. Oh, I missed. Ugh. I need one more hit. I literally need one more hit. Okay, good. Got the shields down. And... Kaboomski! Uh-oh. There's no time to salvage the enemy ship. You must jump away before the cruisers get in firing range. Okay, fine. Where did... Oh, I forgot to... Yeah, never mind. You go fix... Oops, not what I meant to do. You go heal. You go heal. And everybody back to where you're supposed to be. Except that you are supposed to be in here. Okay. Save that, because I'm down a guy. How are you doing at piloting? Okay, you're getting better. You're getting better. Cool, 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 cool. Alright. Well, that was our harrowing escape. We need to get the heck out of here. And I think the last video, when I thought I was here, when I was actually here, I decided to go to the nebula. Yeah. I, I want to get a slug. I want to get a slug man. The only thing that can render a nebula more dangerous is if it's also home to the slugs. This particular nebula is just that. Yeah, because the slugs are psychic or something. Yes, yeah, so we got a lot of nebula. Which is annoying because our scanners are going to look like this. But it's useful because the rebel pursuit will be a lot slower. And the exit's way over here. So this is the terrain that we will navigate in the next video. But in the meantime, thanks for watching this video, and I will see you guys later.